happyfuture.com and this is your horoscope from the 9th to the 15th of September. So this week we have got a full moon coming. It is a full moon in your sign Pisces. It is also going to be conjunct your ruler Neptune. So this is a double whammy of Pisces energy. It's going to be really, really intensely magical. So for you, you are going to be inundated with um, signs from the universe, synchronicities, weird little coincidences, dreams, um, visions even, daydreams, like all of this kind of stuff is going to be like coming at you from all angles. So make sure that you are staying open to it. You're not getting swept away by it, you're staying grounded. Um, if you need to go out in nature and kind of do a bit of like barefoot walking in nature, just like ground your energy into the earth so you're not swept away into the ether with all of this kind of um, magical energy. In addition, uh, with the full moon being opposite Mars, um, we're going to have this kind of like tug of war between um, wanting to get swept away to the ether with all of this like magical energy and also getting all of your stuff done. So this is not really the kind of week for making a massive to-do list and then expecting to get it done. Um, you will feel motivated to, uh, towards doing stuff, but then you will also think, oh, but actually I'd rather be um, you know, watching this documentary about um, aliens or you know, um, you'd rather be reading a book about like fairies and dragons and like getting lost in a world of like creativity and magic. Um, so if you do have a lot of stuff on this week, try and carve out some time where you can just kind of like play and be yourself um, and connect with yourself a little bit deeper because that will really help you to continue getting that stuff done. Because if you just focus on one or the other, so you get completely lost in the world of like fairies and dragons, then you won't get your stuff done. Um, and you know, you'll be left next week with a load of chores and work that you didn't do. Um, if you focus on the other end of things and you just only do the chores and the work, then you'll just feel really kind of dissatisfied um, and tired and a little bit like unhappy with things because you're not playing in the magic as well. So try and go somewhere in the middle, get all your stuff done and then go out and play. Essentially that's going to be the best balance for you this week um, and to yeah, make sure that you are looking out for all of these like weird and wonderful signs that I mentioned as well. So happy full moon Pisces, I hope it is lovely for you and I will see you next time.